prices. We've got just a spectacular hour. Um, and I want to give you a peek at the beautiful butterfly jewelry. I'm wearing the necklace. I love the necklace and I love everything that um, butterflies represent. It comes in, you know, it's funny. I was talking to Michael before the show. This necklace comes in pink and blue. But when you say pink, the gemstones that make it pink are just, I mean, it's positively, you know, you know, it's unbelievable, gorgeous, best of the best gemstones creating pink or blue. And I'll go into more detail when we get to the gemstones, but we're gonna jump in with the multi-stone band ring that I'm wearing. This ring is really the signature piece of Michael's collection. This ring is the one that kind of started it all for him. And what he's done is over the years, he's done different versions of it. But this particular one is really changed up the gemstone. So Michael, let's talk about what's actually in the, what's actually in the ring, because it's pretty incredible. This is my new Carnival. There was an original Carnival and I've made a special version just for HSN. My original Carnival sold 32,000 units worldwide. But this one, I have pulled out all the stops. This one has everything. I wanted to give you a multi-gem ring that literally had it all. This is what I've done with this ring now. I've included the Amatista Amethyst for the first time. Included Burmese Ruby, Grizzly Emerald, Pod Parasha Sapphire, Cobalt Spinel. These have never been seen in one ring before. The Tanzanian Aqua, like in today's special. Two colors of the new Congo Tourmaline. Alexandrite. Dauphine Apatite. And now, two Tanzanites. There are 26 stones, 18 different varieties. And this is just a small smidgen of what you're going to get here. All the stones that you want. You know, I know it's hard, folks, sometimes to decide, what do I want? Do I want the Burmese Ruby? Do I go for the Dauphine Appetite? Do I swing for the uh, incredible Alexandra? How about the Cobalt? How about the Aquamarine? Here's the Pod Paracha. You don't have to decide. I gave you everything in one ring. There are 26 stones for basically $10 a stone, including a mount now that's three grams heavier. <laughs> <laughs> $10 a stone, you're getting every single exotic gem you can imagine. I'll tell you what it doesn't have, diamond. It has everything but diamond. You name it, it's in that ring. And look at the size. You could even see the, you know, like a candy color rainbow ring with that beautiful, uh, you know, Burmese ruby and yellow sapphire from Thailand, yes. cobalt blue yes. spinel. I mean, the yes. tanzanite, the peridot, green peridot. sapphires. I mean, those, yes. those, I mean, you see the peridot next to a green right. sapphire. Is this yes. really, uh, I mean, this is extraordinary. It really is. I mean, you have the royal blue sapphire now, of course, from, from uh, Canchonari. I didn't have that before. Now we have the Timai yellow sapphire. That's from the Timai mine just outside of Chantanabury. We have, of course, the imperial Russian chrome diopside. We have citrines. We have the London blue topazes. And, of course, we have that wonderful, beautiful, the new, that red garnet, that almondine variety, that very, very red garnet that comes out uh, to us from Mozambique. We have all these incredible varieties of stones, but the stones that you really want, Helen, the Pod Paracha, name me one ring for sale in the United States that has Alexandrite, Pod Paracha Sapphire, Grizzly Emerald, Cobalt Spinel, Tanzanian Aqua in one ring. Nobody has it, including Burmese Ruby. Those are the most coveted exotic stones in one ring for basically 10 bucks a stone, mounting included. Think about that. Yeah. This is an incredible, this should have been my, this, it, it, this, it, it, we actually had this on the table as, as a potential today special. That's how much they loved it. But I couldn't get enough of the pod for No, I was, I was about I to say, I, I can't yeah. imagine that you would get enough of them to, to support an entire day of a today special, exactly. especially with some of these specialty exotic blue aquamarine, how many you would have to get of those in the pod parasha, not to mention that, or even, even that special 
a amethyst. I mean, I've seen yeah. amethyst, but look at the look at that amethyst color. Look how rich. I mean, that is the deepest amethyst oh, yeah. I've yeah, ever so seen. That's yeah. um, amethyst. Look at it, and it's yeah. kind of blue. The, the amethyst has a color shifting property. Look at all these exotic alexandrite. I mean, do you know how expensive alexandrite sells for hundreds of dollars a carat? It's included. That's pod paracha included. Yellow tea my sapphire. Look at this beautiful uh, tan on it. Here is the emerald. There is the incredible um, amethyst, the citrine, the London blue topaz, the peridot. There is the color-changing uh, garnet from Tanzania, the Congo tourmaline. They just discovered Congo tourmaline. It's already in the ring. So <laughs> you discovered you it in the it ring. All. You know, if you yes. want to be a graduate gemologist, Michael, you can just buy this ring and study it. <laughs> right? and basically, that's it. And it also has the seven most important shapes that we use in jewelry. You know, baguettes, pear shapes, marquees. So it's kind of a geology lesson. It's like for someone who says, I don't know what to get. Why don't you get the variety box? It has everything in it. But this is one that you're going to own and love for the rest of your life. Now, it's a full eternity band. Stones go all the way around. You know what I love about it too, Helen? If you want to change the look, just twist it on your finger and you're into a whole different color group. Right. And so it always changes with you. And I, now, if it's true to size. Yeah, I was going to say, if, you're, a, if, if you're, you're between sizes, though, I would size up. I go up. Yeah. Yes, I would do that too. Yeah. Definitely, definitely. And notice when you put it in your hand, there's a heft to it. I mean, this is a well made ring. We don't make flyweight jewelry. This is built to last. Like you take, you do the thumb, you try to squeeze that. You can't bend that. This is made with two separate pieces the inside ring and the outside ring. What's the big deal? It lasts forever. Hmm. 20 years from now, you're still wearing this. I'm oh, not yeah. kidding. You feel that. Feel that ring. This is high-end jewelry, not at a high-end price. High-end exotic stones, but not at a high-end price. That's what I do. I bring you the luxury in a format that's affordable and not going to tarnish because of that silver palladium. That's gorgeous. It's so pretty. And I think that there's something really optimistic. When I think about how the headspace I want to be in moving forward. It's, I, if I had to have one word, it would be optimistic. And there's something about this carnival, candy coated, uh, you know, when you talk about, you know, the, the different colors, the confetti, the carnival, it, it's just, you know, like rainbow. I love all the different gemstones. It puts a smile on my face. This is, it's hard to be sad when you're looking at these beautiful gemstones dazzling back at you, Michael. Absolutely. In this one ring, you can have a sampling of basically all the gems that I brought to HSN, all the new exotic gems. In one piece, you can have it all, and that's what I love about it. And that's why the original was so popular, but this new updated version, I put a lot of effort into it. You know how hard it was, Helen, for me to get you Pad Paracha? Mm -hmm. Alexandrite, you know how expensive those stones are? I put them in the Cobalt Spinel. These are all new discoveries. Look. Look at the quality of what's on your screen there. Everything you see here plus double that is inside this ring. I didn't have a turntable big enough. <laughs> I just didn't have one to show all the 26 varieties that you're getting in here. But I'm showing you here the most important ones. I mean, look at that spinel. Look at that aquamarine, the pod paracha, the yellow sapphire, the green sapphire, the emerald, the tanzanites. Oh, my. It has it all. <laughs> it is. It's, it's like you're walking down the yellow brick road and the yellow bricks yeah. are multi-gemstones. <laughs> it's just really <laughs> an incredible fantasy of jewelry. And by the way, very popular. You're loving it. You're saying yes to that, you know, the amethyst, the rubies, the Burmese rubies, the cobalt blue yeah. spinel, the peridot, the tanzanite, the tourmaline, the aquamarine. You're saying I've got to have it. This is brand new. This is exclusive. Of sizes yeah. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12, and all precious metals. That gold you're seeing is 18 karat gold. It's rhodium plated. You've got, you know, members of the platinum family. It's on over sterling silver. So you're not going to have any of those tarnishing issues because you've got that palladium alloy. And if somebody's just tuning in again, Michael, I know you're, we're repeating ourselves, but I want everyone to really understand what it's made of what this jewelry is made of when it comes down to it. Tell us about that palladium alloy. Until the discovery of this alloy, I never actually sold silver. I always sold gold because, you know, I knew silver tarnished. My wife had silver jewelry and always tarnished. And I went to the Tucson Gem Show, I think it was 2004. 
and United were fighting. They had a booth there, and we've dealt with them for years. And, hey, guys, how are you? And I said, you know, you guys should invent a silver that doesn't turn. She says, we did. And he gave me a jar. He says, why don't you try this out? He explained to me what it was. Took it back. We cast it. And it's like, are you kidding me? He explained to me. I went down to visit him. He's only about an hour and a half away from here across Lake Ontario. It's silver and palladium. They melted it together. Sounds easy. It's not because they melted very different temperatures. They figured out a way to do it. And as they melted it together, they found tarnishing. Forget about it. Gone. You don't have to worry about it anymore. Mm-hmm. And then we use real 18 karat gold. So this is affordable luxury. It gives you the performance of, of a gold without it actually being 10 karat gold. So you can swim with it, steam clean it, ultra soft. How many people who sell you silver tell you to steam clean their jewelry? Never. So you just put it in regular jewelry cleaner. No one ever tells you to do that. But with, and proudly, it's made in Buffalo, New York. Proud to say, mm-hmm. this American-made alloy is never going to tarnish. And it's built my career, actually. So I'm very proud of it. Yeah, and... And, and it is it is unique to this line of jewelry. Uh, we're going to go to the phones. We're going to go to New Jersey and welcome Joanne into the show, who's a big fan. Hi, Joanne. You're on live Hi, with Helen how and Michael. Are you guys? We're good. We're enjoying good. some gemstones. How about Michael, you, Joanne? It's been a while since I've talked to you, but you are fantastic. I have oh, so much of you. your jewelry. It's unbelievable. <laughs> Anybody that buys anything from you, they'll never be disappointed. And I have a couple of requests. Oh, okay. Yes, Go Joanne. ahead, Joanne. Would you make some pot of Eva necklaces like you made the big pot of Eva ring, which I have from the topaz? Oh. Beautiful. Really yeah, nailed I, color. I, I'm actually, Joanne, I'm looking into it. I'm looking into acquiring that stone again. Um, yeah, I'm having a bit of a challenge, but give me a few months. I will do fabulous. it again because I, really I know you love it. I know. I've got it I right know. over here. It's fantastic. Yeah, you nailed the color. And the other thing is, would you bring some cat rings? Because I never did get one of your cats. Oh, okay. I would love to. Oh, I know. We used to do so many theme collections. I'll do one for you. I promise. Yeah, I'd love that. Oh, there you go. Oh, thank you. That's a, thank you. you yes. Thank yes, you, Joanne. Buddy, you see, you made a request, <laughs> and now you're going to get a, you're going to get a ring created yes. because of you. Absolutely. <laughs> Thank you, Joanne. Thank you so much for calling. Today. That's the great thing about live TV, right? You can call, call the number yeah. on your screen. You can say hi, use the testimonial line. And listen, Michael wants to hear from you. He wants to know what you want to do. He he is your personal jeweler, jeweler here at HSN. We're so happy that we landed him and he's part of our HSN family. He's been in the jewelry business for over 42 years, 24 of those. He's been on shopping television, but relatively new to us here at HSN. So there's a lot of you out there who have not had the pleasure of purchasing his pieces before we want to welcome you in and enjoy genuine gemstones with this absolutely unique palladium alloy that is all from uh you know from from you know palladium which is more expensive than platinum and sterling silver this blend no no other jewelry has that it call in and tell us what's your favorite gemstone what and, and michael i want to throw that question to you if you had a favorite yeah. gemstone i know it's like saying which is your favorite child but <laughs> so i'm putting you on the spot here i go back to my first love it was 1979 I was working for a big computer company, probably can't say the name, and um, I saw Amethyst for the first time in my life. This is true. I said, what is that? And I started researching it. Then I decided, I says, you know, I'm going to go back to school. I'm going to get my MBA. I worked in a jewelry store, and that was it. The moment I started handling gemstones, and I researched it, oh, there's GIA in Santa Monica, California, and that began my career. So Amethyst, believe it or not, launched my career and it's still my passion because it brings me back to my first love and i love all gemstones but i look at amethyst it makes me feel like well you know i'm 21 again and <laughs> don't i wish you know it was a long time ago you know? <laughs> for <laughs> me as well <laughs> i don't remember I how long ago that was <laughs> My daughter is actually 21 right now, <laughs> so. I, I, I know, I, I, so, so is my daughter, actually, and I have a, a, a son, two other sons. But anyway, but in this ring here, I have it on the turnstile. As it goes around, focus in on it. Show me your, Helen, you've got it on your hand. Show me the bad stone. There's not one milky stone in that ring. Go ahead. 
Show me the bad stones. Not one stone that you're embarrassed about. Everything top drawer. Every stone sparkles. Look at that, the ruby. Look at the colors that you're seeing there. The alexandrite, the color change garnet, the sapphires, everything you love. Top drawer quality. You're going to love this piece. Look at that. Everything you want. I took away some of the bigger crystals so you could see it, but take a look at that. Every single stone I hand-picked myself. The color, the clarity, the beauty, guaranteed. Guaranteed and exclusive for us here at HSN. Yes. Um, this is an open work, eternity-style band. And when I think about how you would wear it, you could wear this as your wedding band, kind of a combination yes. engagement wedding band. You could wear it as kind of a cocktail ring on your, it would be a right-hand ring. This is the one where, you know, sometimes you go through your jewelry and think, well, what goes with this outfit? So from a practical point of view, mm, this goes with everything, right, Michael? I mean, there's not, it goes it with my green dress. It goes with my blue dress. It goes with my purple dress. Right. It goes with my white dress. It goes with my gold dress. It goes in, with a black dress. It'd be amazing. I mean, there really isn't an. It goes with a pair of jeans and a t-shirt. I mean, there isn't yes. any outfit, you know, because there are gemstones or things like that you don't wouldn't wear together. But really, there because of the carnival and all the multicolors, yes. it goes with everything. It really does. And you think about it, what it contains. What's the most sought after, most precious sapphire in the world? Pot Parachi, It's in there. What's According to GA, 10 of the rarest stones in the world list at the top of the list, Alexandrite. It's in the ring. You've got the biggest names in the ring. Everything you want, it's there. It's fantastic. Yes, and if you love the ring, we do have a matching bracelet. I yeah. have only 100 available. That's it. You can see that it has a wonderful jeweler's double uh, clutch safety on this hinged bangle. So that's wonderful. You don't have to worry about, oh, it's too small or too big. I can't get it over my hand. This is a hinge bangle, 482.25, five flex pay of $96.45. The weight of it, all the precious metals, and then the gemstones are on the front. And let me turn it around with this oval. You see the back, how beautiful that is as well. So I want you to see every detail of it. Uh, absolutely gorgeous. And I believe that this is sized as well. So I have small, medium, and large. The small fits a six and seven sixteenth in the length. The medium is seven and one eighth of an inch, and the large is seven and 15 sixteenths of a, an inch in diameter. So I just wanted to let you know that we've got the one for you, the one that'll fit your, and by the way, the larger one is not more expensive than the smaller one. And there's more precious metal in it. Other places, Honestly, it kind of should be that way with this because you're actually putting in more precious metal for the larger sizes, right, Michael? So you, you, you didn't, yeah, you didn't have a different price for the different sizes, but jewelry stores no, always do. Always, always, always do that. We don't do that. I mean, if you get the large, it's 24.75 grams. This has the same stones as in the ring. It's actually in that bangle. So you can make a really, really nice set. You know what I love about this bangle? It's a traditional hinged bangle. I mean, I love to do my flex cups and all that. They're more, they're better price pointed. But if you're a gal that wants that traditional quality bracelet that's going to last decades, you know what I'm talking about? Your grandkids are wearing this. That's the one to buy. That it's double hinged and it also has a double gallery. So it's very, very well made. When you open it up, you feel the weight. You can just see the way it's made. The hinges are all handmade. The clasp is handmade, all hand soldered. So the workmanship is exquisite. And the gems, same as in the ring. You got every pod paracha, you name it. Oh, I see you got the butterflies. <laughs> all right. <laughs> So, you know, I was talking to Mike, again, we had this, I feel like we could have talked for hours before the show, but on my, on my card, my information card, it says blue or pink. And I said, Michael, hey. pink, that's Burmese rubies, pod Ruby, yes. sapphires, color yes. changing garnet, Congo yes. tourmaline. And tourmaline, they've got pink, that tourmaline, yes. amazing amethyst, <laughs> that special amethyst. It's like, oh, oh we're just going to yes. say pink. I'm like, no, we're I not going to just say pink. <laughs> uh, can you believe all of that? And butterflies are such an amazing image. It's sort of, if you've gone through a change in your life and you've come out of that cocoon and you know what i'm gonna say right now i feel like 2020 we were all in that <laughs> right to donnie's like yep we were all in that and now we're sort of like butterflies coming out in 2021 uh and and we've got a necklace also that's available so uh i believe it's 20 inches yes it's a 
Yeah. Let me see what I got here. 18 inches with a two inch extender. So 18, exactly. 19 and 20 inches. And the bale is quite large. Let me just show you that. Yeah, yes it is. And it, it's the same stones, the same uh, uh, quantity weight as, as there is in their brain. And butterflies, you know, they're beautiful, but they come out of that struggle. When they struggle out of that chrysalis, they start out one way. And it's that struggle that makes them beautiful. Now take a look at in the blue variety there. We have the neon appetite, the dauphine appetite. We have the cobalt spinel. We have uh, the blue sapphire from Canchinabri. And so we've kind of taken the carnival theme, but we split it into two colors, which is what we've done here. And it's two pieces assembly, so that butterfly is separate casting from the base. Why is that important? It's important because we get to pre-polish the pieces. So when you make something in one mold, you open it up, you can't really get to the nooks and crannies. When you make them separate pieces, everything is clean and polished. Then it's finished and put together. So you have a perfect finish with a perfect fit. Fine jewelry is made that way. We still do it that way. See, we make this jewelry as if it was made out of 18 karat gold. We make it to perfection. Wait till you get this piece at home. It's magnificent. Is this an enhancer bale or? It looks like it's an enhancer bale, but it's not. It's just okay. that we build our bale so good. Yeah, your bale, it's so large. I mean, it comes with a chain, yes. but you, of course, yes. can change it out. I love the way it hangs and it really just is place itself very flush. Sometimes, I mean, all those, that's jewelry making like 101. So some, some you, could, you know, lesser jewelry would kind of be a little awkward. I like the way it kind of looks like it's in flight, but it's completely yes. flush. It's just gorgeous. Um, Dania is sporting the blue, which is spectacular, oh. but... Oh. I don't even want to say yeah. blue. That, I feel like that's kind of taking yeah. away from what's going on here. I mean, when you've got Tanzanian aqua, that neon apathy, you can see that actually shining on, on her hands, or the dauphine apathy, the tanzanite, the cobalt spinels, the sapphires, all those precious gems all put together, two and a half carat, that is just an exquisite, exquisite piece. Oh, yeah, just absolutely gorgeous. And butterflies... When you talk about themes in jewelry, like hearts, butterflies, these are the most popular kind of images. And you can see the pink, yeah. the pink stones, all those incredible uh, Burmese ruby. Um, yeah, just amazing. So, and the ring is 265. The pendant yeah. is 260.22 that comes with a chain or either of the color sweets. Are, no matter which one you choose, it's the same price. This is new. This is exclusive. You're not going to see it anywhere else, and I already have an update. The pink pendant that I'm wearing, I have 18 left. Wow. Um, let me grab my card, because let me go through the stones that... Michael, go through the stones again that, that are in the pink. The pink? You have four different pink sapphires. Two Burmese rubies, the new rose garnet, which I haven't even talked about yet at, at HSN. I will in the future. Uh, that comes from Tanzania. Not one, two pod parashas, two of them. The rhodolites, uh, two of the color-changing purple garnets, three of the Congo tourmalines, and the amethysta amethyst, 2.78 carat total weight. The rings of 10 and a half grams. Uh, oh, that's a beauty. Look at that. Burmese ruby, pod parasha sapphire. Yeah. In the pendant, I have 15, one, five. And in the ring, I have less than 100, sizes five through 12. And you think about this necklace. I mean, it's really spectacular. We don't have a lot of these. There's so much detail. You know why I thought this was an enhancer bale? Because there's so much detail on the bale itself in the front and the back. It's really pretty amazing. <laughs> Well, well, with uh -oh. our design house, we believe that the bale is just as, as important as the piece itself, so we decorate it. You're never going to see just a ring bale for me. I don't like that. I want to decorate it. I think when you have the stone quality that I use, you want to make your jewelry beautiful, like a gorgeous frame, you know, surrounding a painting. That's how we make it. All right, we'll keep shopping. I'll let you know when the butterfly necklace is completely gone, but we're going to talk next about our next piece, which is, look at this pink or purple sapphire in this V-shaped band ring. Um, okay, the most valued, sizes five through 12, 
and I believe, let me, I wanna make sure I'm saying this is right. Parapia color topaz? I'm, oh, I have the wrong yes, way. Paraiba. Par paraiba. Oh, paraiba, Paraiba. Yeah, the Paraiba, that's the other item, yes. Okay, all right, so let's talk about this pink or purple gorgeous sapphire V-shaped band ring. Oh, this is just absolutely gorgeous. Now, these stones come from river deposits in, in Thailand, and, and this is where you get them. So as the sapphires tumble down, they get pre-cleaned by Mother Nature. Now, that sounds like it happens quickly. It takes 100, 150 million years for that to occur. So when they, they wind up in the valley, in these rivers, they're very, very clean. Now, this is natural pink. And, of course, we have here the natural beautiful purple sapphire. The purple is almost like a lilac color. And what makes a purple is that it's a pink sapphire with a little bit of blue sapphire. It's like a pink sapphire married a blue sapphire. That's exactly what it is. It's what we call a hybrid stone. And that occurs naturally. Uh, it, it's gorgeous. And you know, Michael, there's so much detail. I have these cards in front of me. That's like a giant deck of cards. And I want to make sure that I'm giving the right detail, the right weight for it. Maybe my producer can help me because uh, I believe this is sizes five through 12. So pink yes. or purple sapphires, there is the uh, pink and this is the purple. It's kind of like a light violet it, with yes. 18 karat gold accents for $399.75. Yes. Um, and this is my first time presenting these. And, and again, these are the soft pastel colors. They're absolutely beautiful. And when we buy the rough, it's all multicolored. It almost looks like, I can't say the name of that, you know that candy that we buy all multicolors? That's what it looks like, except you can see right through them. They're very clean and clear. And what you've got here is the core of the crystal because the outer part gets tumbled away by nature. So you're just left with that pure core. And that's why Helen, these stones are so clear. They've been pre-cleaned by nature. So nature did all the cleaning for us. I've got three dozen in each. Uh, in the pink, two, two full carats of gorgeous pink yeah. sapphires. In the purple, 1.5 carats. And, you know, I'm actually curious, Michael, why is there a different carat weight depending on the color? Is it just the way the stones oh. are cut? Exactly. It, 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 we okay. actually base it on the average weight of, of the stones because they're, they're cut... Um, when the stones occur, the rough is very different. It looks like little pebbles. It actually does look like little round pebbles. So if I were to give them to you in five different uh, uh, colors, these particular variety, the weights would all be slightly different because of the way the crystals are. It's not like other ones, which is a double hexagonal crystal. These are different. They're like they're tumbled. So that's why the different weights occur. Oh, see, I, I love that I know that I can ask you any question. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and, um, <That's> the ending. <laughs> and also, here's another question. You know you have this V yeah. pointing towards you or away from you. Isn't there some sort of significance of that, like I'm available or not available yes. if you have the V? Uh, okay. What is the answer okay, to in that? Austra in Australia, <laughs> um, that means um, I'm available. And if you wear it the other way, it means that I'm taken. But it's the only place in the world that I've ever heard that from. Because I used to do a show in Australia for 10 years, and they always would wear that way. Oh, if I was with a hostess, she was married, she'd wear it one way, or single, she'd wear it the other way. But it's only Australia that I've ever heard that from. I've never actually heard that anywhere else. But <laughs> you know, my, my husband, um, when I met, country, but different. he went to yeah. Australia six times for business. He has a business thing in uh -huh. Australia, back and forth. Uh -huh. Maybe it's something that I've heard from him because maybe I was wearing a ring yeah. and he made some comment about it. But I yeah. knew that there was something about when you have a ring shape like that. So, all right. So yeah. if anybody buys this ring and goes to Australia, make sure you straighten that out. <laughs> <laughs> you don't yeah. want to. You don't want to get attention, unwanted attention, if you have your ring <laughs> pointed in the wrong direction. Sure. But here in the states, you're good to go. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. By the way, this is brand new, brand new. Yes. Um, and brand this, new. and you're also seeing the oval shape and the pear shape in this. It's just this open work, beautiful. And you know what? I bet you someone has a ring that they could even wear on the same hand with that, like a solitaire. Yes, yes. And what I love about this design too with, with, with the, the chevron is that when you do wear it toward your fingernail, it will elongate your hand. And I know me, I'm always looking for anything that'll slenderize me. You know what I mean? So this really, really does work. And again, sapphires, precious. Nine on the hardness scale, and they never color fade. They really are an investment. Next to a diamond, they're the hardest stone you can own. 
All right, gorgeous. All right, don't go anywhere, Michael. Don't go anywhere, everybody at home. We're gonna take a teeny little break. We come back, I've got my final 30 minutes with Michael Valatuti, so stay tuned. We love our gemstones to be beautiful, colorful, and durable. That's why we give some of them a little more love. Enhancements may require special care and may not be permanent, while others may last a lifetime. For more information, visit hsn.com and search Gemstone Care to see our Gemstone Enhancement Chart. The List is your go-to guide for our favorite fashion and accessory finds of the week. We have the best styles hand-picked just for you. Join us tonight to see what made the list. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. Well, I'm so glad you're joining us for the final 30 minutes of Gems by Michael. Michael Valatuti, who has been in the industry for over 42 years, 24 of those years spent shopping on television around the world. It's a global business in 17 countries. This is my very first show. Michael is relatively new here at HSN, so maybe you're meeting him for the first time as well. And he, Michael... Yeah, all the women are falling in love with you because a man who knows gemstones, really, <laughs> what else can you ask for in this world? <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you so much. And I'm so happy to be here, part of the HSN family. And uh, I, I just love you guys. You guys are fantastic. And I love bringing you the exotic stones. You know, Topaz, what I love about Helen is we can give you a size. We can give you clarity. You know, I haven't talked about a lot about clarity, but the top me GIA, getting stones that are clear is really hard to find in nature. So here we have two different topaz, and we're going to start you off with that super Swiss and that heart shape. Wow, look at that color. Oh, that is swimming, swimming pool blue. Love it. It's beautiful, and you talk about clear. You can see, look at how beautifully this is cut. I don't know who specifically does the cutting of your gemstones, but this is done, like, spectacularly well. Thank you. Uh, $213.48 on sale, five flex pay on all gemstones, $42.70. It's 18 inches with a two-inch extender. Um, we do have a 30-day return policy, but I want to mention this once during the show. You've got a manufacturer's one-year warranty on this so for someone who's new shopping with you talk about how you back up your product we back up our product on the little story card you get you will get a toll-free number you can call me this is my office my factory 1-800-268-7962 that's our phone number it's our customer service number jennifer is the person that actually picks up the phone we don't have this press one for this press two for that that bugs me we actually say hello Remember in the 1970s when somebody actually picked up the <laughs> I phone? I remember, That's Michael. That's the way we are here. We go, hi, oh, a human being, yes. <laughs> Hello, how can we help you? It, it throws a lot of people because they're used to machines. Oh. We're people, you're people, we love to help you. Uh, that's so funny, yeah. I get very frustrated. I just start yelling at the phone, person, I don't. help. <laughs> that's what I want to get. Press yes. this, press that. This is. I will never do that to you. A person will always pick up our phone. This is quite large. The total carat weight, 5.3 carats of Swiss blue topaz. Yes. And I think one of the most amazing things about it is how this stone is cut to be in a heart shape yes. at this size. Yes. So the degree and of difficulty, like a gymnast in the Olympics, <laughs> you do that degree yes. of difficulty, the degree of oh, difficulty yeah. at a large stone like this cut into a heart. Let's talk about that, Michael. Well, because it's like being on the high beam, and I love the high beam. I don't know how they do that. It's, I, mean, <laughs> I don't know, either. Put backwards and all this. And, and what I love about this is that it is the heart shape. Now, why don't we see a lot of heart shapes, Helen? I'll tell you why. In stones, you know, in opaques, you see it a lot, but you don't actually see it in clear stones. It's because to cut the cleft, that's where the heart, you know, the, the lobes of the heart, they meet. That has to be done with, with a diamond saw, not, not a skate, a saw. So they actually have to make a vertical, vertical cut. So they can't do it along the cleavage plane. I know I'm being all geeky here, but they have to figure out exactly where to cut it. And if they haven't oriented, if they orient it along the cleavage plane, when they cut it, it'll split. So they lose a lot of stones in the cutting. That's why you don't see a lot of hearts in stones like that. We know how to cut it. 
We know how to do it. Notice, Helen, there's no dead spots in that stone. Yeah. Look I'm trying to spot. move it around oh. so you can kind of see yeah. it from all the angles. Yeah, no it's, dead spots, yeah. It's really spectacular. I've just... Thank you. The color, ama just amazing. Oh, yeah. And this is... And let me show you the back as well. And, you know, cut into a heart shape is amazing. So you've got the 18 inches with a two, in two inch extender. Item number 765-812. But we're gonna continue on and talk about the ring that I have on. Okay. I only have 90, so this is going to be yeah. very quick uh, of this Parapia color topaz. Paraiba. And pa Paraiba. Paraiba. Color Paraiba. Right. There you go. Sorry. sorry. Do you know what? It, I have not pronounced this because I have not sold. I have not presented. I have not yeah. seen the Apara Iba Topaz before. Yeah. And it's, it's something that I actually developed, actually. And what it is, is it, it, it's based after the Petty Iba Tourmaline. Now, I want to tell everyone if that was a Petty Iba Tourmaline, you could buy a car with <laughs> it. I'm not kidding you. That's how rare and expensive it is. Big stone like this Petaiba is half a million dollars, and I mean that literally. It really is. So what makes a Petaiba tourmaline? It's the copper. It's what we call a Cuprian tourmaline. So being the gemologist I am in there, I'll bet you I can do that, which you're seeing right over here in a topaz. I work with an American company out of the state of Minnesota, and we developed the process of infusing this topaz with copper mimicking the color of an expensive Petiba tourmaline perfectly. Our last caller that we had, she says, can you make me a necklace? Everybody wants this. Do you know that this was worldwide my number one selling topaz? It's unlike anything you've ever laid your eyes on. And it's the only one that's colored by that element of copper. It took me over a year to figure out how to do it. We did it. But now because of COVID, I'm trying to get more. I'm working with them. But anyway... This is very, very special. It's from my inventory. Again, that last caller, first thing she asked, can you get me that in a necklace? Will mm -hmm. you get this at home? Oh, my goodness. Yeah, oh. and by the way, 4.23 like 4. 4. carats. 4.23 carats. I, You know, when I look at this stone, I, it doesn't really look like anything that I've ever seen before. It doesn't look like a color yes. that I've ever seen before. And what you were describing before, as the human eye is drawn to colors that are not found in nature but are natural, it's, that's what this yes. is. Well, exactly. You know, I'll tell you how, to, how I've always described it. Um, take Sleeping Beauty, make it transparent like a diamond. Wouldn't it look like that? Oh, wow. <laughs> it's exactly what it is. It's like transparent. Sleeping Beauty, because both are colored by copper. Copper, um, all elements, uh, they trigger a certain wavelength. I know I'm being geeky here, but I, I want to explain the science. Why do we like things? Why are things beautiful? So that's the science. When the wavelength hits the stone, selective absorption, it's all because of the copper in it. And the wavelength that comes back to your eye, oh my goodness, that's beauty. That is just gorgeous. I love it. Seven six five nine seven nine seven seven six five seven nine seven. Forty dollars on Five Flex Pay. All jewelry on Five Flex Pay today. We've got about twenty minutes left. Drum roll, please. We're about to talk about Pod Parasha sapphires, and I will tell you, I bought myself a Pod Parasha sapphire ring maybe twelve years ago. It is a prized possession. And it is quite a bit smaller than this, <laughs> than, than this one. So um, we've got two different uh, shapes with this in, in this clustering. Hmm? I, I, I believe we have it in a, a square and a, and a diamond shape, sizes five through ten in this diamond accent ring. I think these are two different rings. I see see what we're doing. So we're doing the cluster yeah. ring first. Right. With or without diamonds. That's what it is. Oh, the... Uh, the this is the, the one with diamonds, uh, and this hit, is the one yeah, without. Exactly, yeah. That's, exactly, exactly. There's two different ones. Now, when I said it to Jay, if you want to know the definition of exotic, it is pod paracha. It should not be here. The only reason we have pod paracha is because of COVID. COVID hit. I met the gentleman in Tucson. His prices, forget it. I walked away. About six weeks later, after COVID hit, his business stopped, as everyone else's did. 
We started the negotiation process. I bought this at a price that I will never get again. What you see here on my turnstile, that's all I have left. Oh, my gosh. Pot Paracha sells for a fortune. Here's another ring. I want to um, take a bath in that. Send. Com. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> that's that's, so that's HSN.com. That's almost sold out. But no one has this. I'm the only guy on TV that has the Pot Paracha. It should not be here. Yeah. The one with diamonds should be seven, eight hundred dollars I have to do an update. Not I have 15 without the diamonds, one, five. 15. Size, yeah. size five, seven, ten. That's it. The one with That's the it. diamonds, I have all sizes, five through 11. So, but we're yes. also limited in that one as well. Yeah, I was gonna say this, I mean, I can count the number of times on one finger how many times I've had Pod Parasha sapphires. And the only reason I know what they are is when I took a course in colored gemstones when I became an accredited jewelry professional. That's where I learned about what they were. But it's the kind of thing that you see in the Smithsonian or the Tower of yeah. London or at the right. Place Vendôme, not on HSN, yeah. <laughs> really. No, it, it honestly shouldn't be here. I'll be honest with you. It actually should not be here. It, it, it's because of what's happened in the world that I was able, he needed money. I wired him the money. We got the stones. It was the deal of a lifetime. I'm sorry that I got it because of COVID, but that was the only good thing that came out of it <laughs> was me getting this pod paracha sapphire. I tell you the truth. That's all I have left. Um, my buyer will do anything to get more. I've had calls from shopping channels in Europe saying, if you have more, could you come here? I'm there. No, I have no more. No one can get this at this price. It should not be here at this price. Pot paracha is hundreds and hundreds of dollars per carat in commercial goods. And if you Google a flawless pot paracha sapphire, one carat, it's $15,000 for the stone. That's $5,000 more than a D flawless diamond, one carat. So that's how expensive these stones can get. <laughs> oh I don't know goodness. how I have it. Luck, get it, you'll almost never see it again. That's all I got to tell you. I do have a necklace Look at that also. Tender. But the necklace is yeah. ginormous. Like, I can't believe yeah. how big the stones are in the necklace. 32, I know. I, yeah, I mean, yeah. it's just amazing. So it is going to be coming up. We do have the necklace available. I think maybe we're going to go to that. Oh, we are. Okay. I have three dozen. And that's it. Look at that. Is that not spectacular? Three, $339.75. You could spend that on a resin bracelet at a department store. And you're getting Pod Parasha sapphires. $67.95. If you watch Jewelry at HSN over the past 20, 30, 40 years that we've been here, 44 years, this I, I bet you you're not like, oh, I remember that Pod Parasha show. Because you don't. Because there wasn't one. This is really pretty amazing that I'm... I, I mean, and the quality of these pod parasha, th that color is so unique that I can identify the color, but it's, like I said, I, I own an earring, a, a ring that it's much smaller than this. And uh, I mean, nothing like this, just really amazing. I do have earrings as well. Pair or marquee cut in the earrings, $240. I have eight pairs. 20 in the marquees. So eight in the pear cut, 20 in the marquee cut. That's um, it. It was, there's, you know that there's the marquee Senate, cut. It's the first time in my career that I've ever had Pod Paracha. I launched this here in February when I launched my career here at HSN. I, I've never had this before. The other networks never had this. It was never available. I mean, you, I could go and buy it, but I was going to pay two, three thousand, four thousand dollars a carry. I wasn't going to do that. I wasn't going to go to air with $2,000. $3,000 pod paracha ring. So that's why I never carried it. I'd say great stone, a little bit out of my price point. I don't want to be that high. Always right. walked away from it. Well, the, the planets aligned. Here it is. Yeah. And I, I, that's it. And I and I used it in that, that attorney band, you know, in our in our carnival. That's it. I That's why I limited this. Do you know I was supposed to make hundreds more of this and I couldn't do it because I couldn't get the pod parachas. We actually had a short ship. I can't get the stones. Mm. All right, let's Fantastic. talk about gemstones. <laughs> let's take a look okay. at this beauty coming up. There we go. Belmont okay. Emerald Zircon and yes. Spinel Oval Ring. I am not going to lie to you, preparing for the show, I had to Google Belmont Emerald because I thought, what is, I mean, we don't even, I, I, this is my very first time holding a Belmont Emerald. And I know yes. it is from one place in the world. 
where this particular deposit, it's, it's yeah. uh, you know, a large carrot. I'm gonna tell you the carrot weight of the center stone. 1.2 carats in Brazil from the Belmont mine. I mean, let's talk about this. Look at that green and look, I love the way the design is too, because you could have just left oh. this as a solitaire with, with nothing. I love the way you did the black spinel and the white zircon. It's almost looks like a flower with a green, green center. It's just incredible. It, it does, and I actually have a. Um, I did on air. I did video of me, but here I am. I'm at the Belmont Mine, so I actually did visit the Belmont Mine, and I was their guest. Belmont is a very, very incredible deposit in Brazil. It's a schist deposit like Grizzly, but it's different because their schists are vertical. So, in the Grizzly, oh, there I am. There I am at the Belmont Mine. And the Belmont Mine is very, very big. Now, you see those hills that I'm talking about? Their schists are vertical versus horizontal. So because of that, it gives its emerald something that we call size. Because of that, we're able to get larger specimens out of the Belmont Mine. Now, there I am when they first were pulling some out. And I'm pointing to the schist. You can see that green where my flashlight is. So that's what they do. They mine it out. They blast it out. And they pick it from the walls. That is where they get these. So because it is a vertical wall, the emeralds grow bigger. So this is why this is so large. Grizzly, it's hard to get stones this size. They're great quality. But Belmont, you get color and you can get size. And that's the last for my trip that I did in Brazil. And this is how it comes out of the ground. You see how big the crystals are? And that is pure Belmont emeralds. And I think I'm the only guy on TV to have these for uh Belmont emeralds. They're fantastic. Well, like I said, I've only been here for a quick 13 years, and I've done a lot of jewelry <laughs> shows. I do a lot of shows. I've done jewelry host pick and jewelry specials. I've never even seen or heard of a Belmont yeah. emerald. I mean, that's when you, you know, we try to keep our prices, like we wouldn't show a ring that's twenty, thirty thousand dollars $30,000. You know, yeah. it, it just, it's just not, it's just not the kind of the way we are in the marketplace. So we genuinely don't, you know, have, uh, we'd love to see things like this, but never present it. And how you got this for $396.36, again, you can go to a department store and get like a, a, a plastic resin bracelet or something for that price. It's just, uh, it, it's just incredible. I'm speechless <laughs> at what we're doing here with this. And take this to your jeweler. Have this oh, yeah. appraised. I okay. should have said that at the beginning of the two hours. Yeah. Add it to your homeowner's insurance. Uh, I, I yeah. am looking forward to hearing what what your appraisals are on these pieces <laughs> because oh, I, totally. you know it's gonna it's your eyes you're gonna be wide-eyed when you see the only way to get prices like this Helen is to do what I did look I got the helmet on they make you wear that I, I <laughs> you went to get the, the actual mine and I bought the rough that's what I did you can't just call someone can you have a delivery of Belmont no no you know what you're gonna pay you go there you visit them you negotiate and you wire the money and you walk away with the, the actual emerald rough, the gravel, that's what you do. You take the thing, you send it to your cutting facility in Bangkok, where we do the cutting. <laughs> that's how I did it. I cut out all the middlemen by doing that. But by doing that, I can give you a stone that's over a carat for this price. Now, this is all I've got left in my parcels. That's it. There's no reorders on this. I told my buyer, that's all I can get at this price. That is a magnificent deal. Yeah, it, it is. You know, uh, I know you're relatively new here at HSN. I sort of equate it to like what Jay King does with like lapis yeah. and, and, you know, material like that. You do with fine uh, gemstones. It's really kind of a, a different kind of process, but you go to the yeah. source and go to the mines and then bring it direct to us. And as far as fine gemstones, it, it really usually never, ever works that way. I lived in New York City for yeah. uh, 15 years, and I went down to the Diamond District and saw you know, all the pieces. And even then, like, that's, that, I felt like, oh, I'm going right to the source to get, you're, you're 15 middlemen back already. You're already back. Oh, yeah. I, <laughs> you're already, I actually you're already, don't you're already digging it. Because, I mean, I mean, and I have, I have like two hours of video, the sorting facility and all this. I mean, and, and, you, and they give it to you. Believe it or not, the rough comes in a sack. Believe it or not, it's in a, like a potato sack. And all the rough is there, and they put on a scale, and they sell it to you in kilo. In kilo. Kilo is about one kilo is 2.2 pounds, and it's a lot of money. And you go back and forth, and they give you their, that, it's called the SWIFT number. And that's how you actually transmit the money. And here, I want to show you. Look at the color of this, natural. So if you're thinking, oh, they did something to that, oh, so, no, no, look at this. 
Mm. I mean, it's absolutely gorgeous. And, and Michael's it putting the so light through it because it. that's the talent yeah. of the lapidary. The person who's cutting the Look stone is to bring the light out in it. And I think it's also a combination of who's ever cutting your stones, just like a spectacular job. Let's talk about your white zircon. How is that different? Yes. I know we have a picture. Let's talk about that yes. element, Michael. Uh, the white zircon we use, thank you. The one on the right is the white zircon we use. That is the white zircon on the left that a lot of other people use. So what is the difference? Did you know that there's three types of zircon, type 1, type 2, type 3? Zircon is almost as old as emerald. So we use what we call new zircon. Well, new zircon is about 200 million years old. Can you imagine that's considered new? It actually is. The older zircon is over a billion years old. So it's been in the earth so long, it begins to decay under the pressure. It begins to dematerialize, and it gets cloudy. That's not the product that we use. There's three types. We use a type one, the newer. The newer looks just like diamonds. It's only been in the earth a couple of hundred million years, couple of hundred million years which, by the way, <laughs> oh, <that's> geologically, <laughs> it's an infancy. You know, considering the, the age of the Earth and the universe, 200 million years is nothing. It's new. I just, I, and you know what, even if this was not a genuine Belmont emerald, if it was a piece of yes. glass, the artistry yes. it takes to make this ring could justify the $396 price of pr yes. all precious metals and that palladium uh, alloy with palladium and sterling silver. So there's all precious metals in this, all genuine gemstones, and that center emerald, it's 1.2 carat genuine yes. emerald. And look at the grade of that. Even if you haven't gone to classes in school like Michael and I have, and you just, you just, just from the eye, and by the way, that's how yes. gemologists do it, is they eyeball it, right? right? It's the right. color situation. You, you yes. can tell this is a high quality well, emerald, right? And it's carat 20, it, it's a size, and it's, it's a big deal. You know that, I mean, you studied, you took the, the, uh, the accredited jewelry program at GIA. They taught you how important size is in a gemstone. Most gems are quite small. When I can say precious emerald, a carat 20 finished weight, from a world-famous Belmont mine, which, by the way, you can read about it at GIA.org. I visited it. They gave us lessons on it. It's a major, major production facility. I, I did read about it. Emerald. I had to Google it because I'd never yeah. seen one before. And, 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 and you can see all the magazines that's been published and all this. And you get these large crystals because, again, the schist is vertical. So here it is again on my turnstile. And look at the natural color. So, you know, people are going to look at that. And by the way, this little light, this is what we use when we go into a mine. We shine the light through the stone to see if it has any potential. And it does. This is an absolutely exquisite stone. Natural green. And I like to do this because I think a lot of people think, oh, they dyed it. They, you know, they did something to it. No. This is the green as it came out of the mine. I was there. There's actually, I uploaded a lot of videos, but there's one where I'm actually pointing to it and they just blasted. And these emeralds were exposed in this black schist uh, wall. When I say a wall, the wall was maybe 40 feet high. It was huge. These are big, big internal caverns. And I felt like Snow White. You know when you're, they're in there with, the, with all the gems sticking in the ceilings and all this? Yes, and, yes. Uh, and that's exactly what I felt like. It was just an amazing experience. You know, let me ask you this. When you've got that light and you're shining in the sample, what happens if it's a bad sample? What will happen? Will it just be oh, opaque? Because I've never seen yeah. that before. Basically, but we use this light, so if it's a bad one, we're going to go like this. For, for example, like, and because I use this for air, so if I shine it into the light there, and I can't see to the other end, I know the stone is opaque. So right away, uh -huh. I can judge, because you're being off with the rough, and this is very important. This is how you judge the potential. We call it yield. So I know that if I'm buying 100 pounds of rough, how much pounds am I going to get of finished goods? Because that's where you make your money. The rest is waste, right? And that's so if he's asking like $100,000 for that rough, I got to look and go, after I cut it and do all this, can I at least get my cost out of it? And that's called yield. And if you can't calculate yield, trust mm. me. You know all the stuff they taught us in high school in math that actually applies to real life? So, <laughs> that's um, it. <laughs> I actually had to use it all, yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, the, that's, that's what we use the, the amount of that's expertise yield. that you need to have. And also, it seems like that's like a high pressure moment, Michael, when you're you've got somebody looking at you and you've got a pile yeah. of these, you know, hundred thousand dollars worth of gemstones. Right. And they're like, well, do you want it? <laughs> I mean, that seems like a high and, pressure moment to me. 
It is, and you've flown all the way there. You've only got a few days. It's not like you spend weeks there and all this. You've got a family, right. you got to get back. And you probably have competition you know you for it, it as well. There's probably a line of people yeah, exactly. that want it. Absolutely. So you've got to offer the right price that is going to work. And then I have to think, what am I going to ultimately sell it for? Because I want it to be three ninety six, not nine ninety six. Uh, exactly. You know? so, right. Exactly. And this is, and that's it. Now look at what you're getting at the Care Twenty Center Stone alone. I've offered a lot of emeralds here at HSN since I began in February. Only one was ever over a carat. There it is. There it is. One. Yeah. There and, it is right there. There and, it is. And That's the value the goes up exponentially, and exponentially, right, Michael? It's not like, yes, oh, it it's like 0 0.2. When you go to 0 0.4, it's double. That's not how it works. When you get over a carat, yeah. it goes up a huge amount. It's, it's, it's exponentially more valuable. So I'm so excited for those of you who got this brand new and exclusive gorgeous Belmont Emerald at 396.36. By the way, if you have an HSN card, you do get an extra extra flex pay. It's $66.05 on your HSN card, Q card, or on your Zulily card, because we accept all three to get that extra flex payment. By the way, if you missed the today's special, we have so few left. I'm not even doing a full presentation. It breaks my heart. <laughs> garnet, color changing garnet, gorgeous tanzanite, and aquamarine is our today's special. Sizes 5 through 12, a huge customer pick, 075609. I know we're only going to do like a minute and a half on the today's special, but uh, Michael, t I'm fascinated by the color changing garnet. The color changing garnet is absolutely gorgeous. It is completely natural, ladies and gentlemen, and it's two garnets that are formed together quickly and it has the chromium content and it's that chromium that reacts to the different wavelengths of indoor light and outdoor light and causes what I call a perfect color change because it's a pinkish in indoor light, but you take it outside and it goes purple. See, oftentimes color change stone, Helen, they'll be kind of ugly in one color light, but nice in the other. This looks good indoors and out. That's my kind of garnet. <laughs> indoor, and yeah, and here it is, indoor. Here's your indoor yeah. moment with yeah. your today's special garnet. Oh, look how beautiful look and rich and incredible. Yes. I know we had like a video of showing the colors uh, change. Yes, we do actually. Uh, yeah, we do. And, and which was fascinating. We also have, of course, Tanzanite, 165.58, and then the Aquamarine at 227.68, oh. which is beautiful. And I know how expensive Aquamarine is. I've showed a lot of gemstones and we say things like this looks almost like an aquamarine <laughs> right let me right, just kind of right. lean over and grab them so you can see all That's of them the best I've ever sold. yeah it's, it's from tanzania and it is basically look at that do you believe that that's aquamarine? That's the top 5% in the world of aquamarine. Almost no aquamarine even approaches that color. Look how gorgeous. All right, so let's show that video of that color change in garnet. I, I, and Michael, yeah. I'd love you to speak to this. Okay, well, what this is, this is in the uh, indoor light. There it is in the outdoor light, and you can see the difference there. You can see how it changes color. I'm trying to actually set it up live here in, in, the, in, in my studio here. But I know we got to wrap it up, but uh, there it is with the rough and there. And I know it's out of focus. I pause. See? And that's Look the actual that. rough, and it's changing color. So it's changing color. Um, how cool is that? Changing color. Yeah, I it's all that. natural, and I'm sorry for being out of focus, but... You know, I can only do so much with Skype. <laughs> Michael, this just flew right by. It was such a pleasure. Um, when are you on again today? Um, I am going to be on my next visit. It's going to be September the 17th, I believe it is. Oh, okay. Well, it's I hope I get show shows today. with you because I've, I've, I felt like it was a lesson in gemology as well as a delightful okay. jewelry show. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> by the way, any Thank piece... You. Any piece that you buy here at HSN has Protection Plus available, powered by Allstate, 24-7, customer service, no deductible. Um, and if you want to see all of Michael Valetudi's pieces for Gems by Michael, you can go to hsn.com, Gems by Michael. So coming up next, Gotta CG, Juliana Rontick's going to be joining me. The dress I'm wearing is going to be presented. Stay tuned. August is HSN's anniversary month, and there is so much to celebrate. I'm number one! She did it! Throughout the month, we're spotlighting the anniversaries of many of the show hosts, guests, and brands you've come to love over the years. This is my absolute favorite event. It's a full month of special programming, products, and can't-miss deals. Origami has been solving our storage problems for years. Tune in all throughout August to celebrate HSN's anniversary month. 
Did you know that we have amazing items and deals you'll never see on air? That's right. You'll only find them at hsn.com. We're talking top brands, exclusive names and bundles, plus thousands of products all the time. Discover all our best deals all in one place, including offers you'll see online only. And with hundreds of videos and customer reviews, we make it easy to shop smart. Click, explore, discover, and get more of what you love. Only at hsn.com.